and welcome to season two of Style Hunt. Now I'm in Paris for the runway shows, but I wanted to take a little time off to talk to some friends and strangers, locals and expats about what they're wearing and why. Chrissy, how are you? I'm good. All the better for seeing you. It's so good to see you. <laughs> I know. So tell me, um, tell me what you're doing in Paris. Tell all of us. Okay, well, we're selling. We've just started the selling period for our shoes. I'm a shoe designer. Um, I make my shoes to, to be unique, to be individual, but to last, to really last. They're made, they're all handmade. I think about timeless pieces, handmade, um, a revolt to, to our fast society, you know. Yeah. I've got my old classics on today. I've got a, an old, uh, Japanese style costume national back in the good old days. Yeah. Uh, a pair of Kenzo Kilot trousers. <laughs> and a piece that I found when I was like 10 years old. I dug it up in my backyard. So, how is this indicative of how you normally dress? I've gone back to my, my classic pieces. You can never go wrong with black. Tell me, what are you wearing right now? Okay. You look amazing. Thank you. <laughs> I have a total look by Carl Lagerfeld. Okay, of course. And uh, yes, of course. <laughs> and some vintage accessories. And uh, my watch is also from Carl Lagerfeld. But okay. it's more like jewelry than a watch. Yeah. It's and uh, my uh, biker jacket is from H&M uh, &M and uh, Margiela. Okay. I'm in love with Margiela. And uh, I have my uh, PS11 by Prenza Schooler. Okay. Is it actually signed it? <laughs> Oh, did they really? Yes, I met them two days ago. Oh, and I was like, yes. Tell me, how do you normally approach like getting dressed for work? And has working for Karl Lagerfeld influenced the way that you dress? Yes, I really like the, the fact that you you know who he is by seeing his clothes every day. You know, yeah. he's not trying to be uh, both like chic but cool. And yeah, I think that's the motto of the brand. So. So I'm here with Michelle Ali Murray. Lovely to see you. Tell me what you're wearing today. I'm wearing all Junior Watamabi and Prada shoes. Wearing Junior Watamabi because this collection was very inspirational for me when I saw it on the runway. The attitude that they carried, the way they walked, they were almost like rebellious rushed of foreign walking into the city but looking sort of Indian. I didn't know where to place them. I thought they were like Indian, American Indian, cardboard, rushed of foreign, something else. Like roots came out of like trees. Yeah. They were just mind blowing. And he yeah. was anyway made last year these patchwork jeans which became a phenomenal. Everybody was uh, wearing these jeans, yeah, copying these amazing. jeans. One time I wore the Comme des Garçons, the two-dimensional collection, which was the, the flat Aaron. I call it flat Aaron Stanley. It was brilliant because the reaction on that piece from the minute I wore it, I left the house, I got into the subway, the conversation between me and the passengers in the subway were very, very uh, mixed. Some people loved it, some people hated it, some people didn't know what it was, some people thought it was a costume, some people... But it was this interaction that they had. Yeah. Um, Tommy and Phil are the two, I think, most, you know, photographers. It's not only a photographer, they already know every collection. The, they have an eye for things and you can even tell as well in their photography when they take the pictures, the pictures that they edit, you know. It's hey, what are you guys wearing? Um, I'm wearing a, a vintage starter jacket for the Sacramento Kings. How old is this jacket? Um, this is like their old color, so this is probably from the 80s? Late 80s maybe? I love that you've held on to it. Oh no. I got, I got this one off eBay. I don't oh, yeah, okay. This is from Veronique Branchine Ho. Okay. I know that's not how you pronounce it, I just like saying Ho. <laughs> <laughs> These are from Conor Garçon. Great. Um, a favorite of talking. Michelle Ellie. Yeah. They're kind of like these lavender judo pants. They're really comfortable. And okay. these floral Nikes. I think they're Bo Jacksons or something. Okay. And you have quite a collection of Nikes, I think. I don't. He does. Oh, really? How many? Well, maybe I have like 50. <gasps> yeah! Oh my god. Yeah, I used to wear like dress shoes while I was shooting and as soon as I started wearing sneakers, I was like, oh, that's so much better. Yeah. Because it's athletic. Running. Yeah, it's like, like for a whole month you're on your feet every day, so it's just yeah. nice. Athletes, are we athletes? Well, I am. <laughs> <laughs> it's like endurance. If, the you, if you huh? choose the right one, you can find some a nice little surprise. No. Celine. Oh my God, Celine. Oh, that's so not fair. 
<laughs> I didn't get into the show. No, people have been putting surprises in my pockets. So. Okay. Can you tell me again what you're wearing? Okay, we I wear like acne coat and skirt from Toga mm -hmm. and the shoes from Mihara Yasuhiro. Okay. Yeah. And what about you? Um, Braishiaga and Alexander One. Okay. And Arichuzala. Okay. And Brantino. Yeah. And Ali Pierre How would you describe Parisian style in comparison to like, the very natural and but it's like very fashionable? Mm -hmm. Yeah. And how does that compare to what you see on the streets in Japan? Uh, Japan is like Sometimes it's too much. Really? <laughs> yeah, but unique. Mm. Ah.